right, so go for it. Tell the, the guys out there what this is. All right, so this is a, a Mossberg 590 that I bought here in town. Um, what's cool about it is it went to a company called Vankomp, which is out of Arizona. It's an 18 inch barrel. They uh, back drill the barrel, then they port it. And I think the number is 36 ports evenly drilled on each side. So it helps uh, reduce flash and as well as compensates. It's got the uh, Vancomps extended one extra uh, extended round mag tube. Got a Surefire uh, grip with a light. Got a Magpul uh, SGA, stock on it. Right? Yeah, that's yeah. a nice stock. Got a Vancomps uh, oversized th safety. So you can see how much larger that is than a standard uh, Mossberg safety. And then uh, it's got Vancomps uh, side saddle carrier on it, which is nice. Uh, it's Velcro, so you can you can buy these separately. Here's the um, so there's the actual slap thing the on there. So you just uh, put it on there, and you can carry extra ones. So say you wanted buckshot, you wanted one fully with slugs. It doesn't matter. Rip it off, throw it on there. You're good to go with whatever reload you need, um, and easy to carry on you if you carry a plate carrier or something like that. Um, they do a little bit of action work, so it's a little bit smoother. And these are just standard Mossberg sites, so. But they're uh, they're pretty nice. I mean, yeah. you can see they got bright orange blade in the front, ghost ring in the back. What uh, what Van Comp claims is that at 25 yards, the gun will pattern buckshot within 10 to 12 inches, which is the average size of a dinner plate. Um, I have tested it. This gun has patterned buckshot at 25 yards within 10 inches. So this Surefire uh, forend, that's pretty cool. It's all molded in there. You know how many lumens that light is? I think, uh, don't quote me, someone's probably gonna correct me. Pretty sure on bright it's uh, 600 and on dim it's uh, 300 lumens. That's pretty comfortable too. Just like naturally fits your hand in there. It's nice, it totally integrates the light into the system. So. Nice. All right, let's see how this thing patterns. So you that's got, slug uh, on the top and buckshot on the... You got buckshot, so this is the buckshot right Yeah, here. that's buckshot. And that's just Hornady Express, uh, their whatever it is, their Hornady's buckshot load. So we'll put all the buckshot in here. All right, here we go. Let's see how this sucker does with the uh, buckshot. Oh, wow, look at that. Yeah, that's pretty tight at 25 yards. I got all the buck, all the buck on the steel at 25 yards. That's pretty good. Kind of see it there. It's pretty tight pattern. Yeah, it is. I'd say that's pretty tight. You get all, all nine buckshot balls on there Yeah. at 25 yards. That's not bad. Definitely bad for the bad guy. So taking the... Uh, Slug, I mean, it doesn't really matter with slugs. I'm, gonna, I'm shooting this thing at an angle. Here, maybe I should shoot yours, huh? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going the wrong way. I should be going this way. I think I'm about to kill your target, dude. <laughs> <laughs> but it's so easy. That's the beautiful thing about the shotguns. They're versatile. So slugs, you're easily, you can hit something at 50 yards, no problem with the slugs. And then uh, obviously with the ghost ring sights, that makes it even that much easier to hit at 50 yards. And then you slap in that uh, buck, that buckshot, double up buck or whatever you're shooting. Still devastating at 25 yards. That's pretty nuts. Very cool. Kind of lost popularity of the AR lately, but it's still an effective weapons platform. Oh, absolutely. Versatile. Nothing's more versatile really than a shotgun. Sure. There's like hundreds of different types of ammo you can shoot through these things, man. I love my shotguns. Matter of fact, you might see a resurgence in shotguns in the next uh, year or so with the hate of the AR-15 in America by the uh, anti-gunners. So you'll probably see shotguns become really popular. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow, look at that. Yeah, that's pretty tight at 25 yards. I got all the book, all the book on the steel at 25 yards. <laughs>